Uh, I want to I want to thank Senator Grassley, and it's it really I think it shows the strong support we have for this bill to have the chairman of the Judiciary Committee uh, with us on this bill. And uh, I want to very much thank Annie and Andrea because uh, their courage, their commitment as survivors, and really their advice uh, to make sure uh, that we understand what the focus is here at the end of the day. And that focus is a safe environment for every student on campus, no matter where you choose to pursue higher education. And every victim deserves the support and services uh, and understanding that there's a fair, thorough process on campus, that these crimes are going to be fully investigated, that it doesn't matter what university you go to, what college you go to, uh, that there'll be consistent procedures across our higher education institutions. Because right now, unfortunately, there's been a patchwork system out there, and there's been a real inconsistency depending on where you go to school, uh, if you unfortunately find yourself as a victim, uh, what you're going to receive and how you will be treated. And we want to end that and make sure that every campus is safe. I've had since the original bill got introduced, um, like many of my colleagues, as Senator McCaskill had said, I've had the chance to visit uh, some of our colleges and universities in New Hampshire, including the Univer University of New Hampshire, Dartmouth, St. Anselm's College, to talk to students and to talk to campus administrators, law enforcement, to get feedback about the bill. And I believe this bill is even stronger than the original bill that we introduced. And you see even more support now uh, for getting this passed. So I look forward to working with my colleagues and making sure that we get this done in this Congress, because this is important for every parent and every student in America. And I'm honored uh, to introduce uh, Senator Gary Peters from Michigan, and we're so glad to have his support on this bill.